Hello everybody, this is Havoc. Welcome to part 18 of our Total War Tilla White Huns campaign. Pick it up uh, where we last left off. We are just continually pursued by everyone that considers themselves a Middle Eastern faction in one respect or another. We just can't catch a break. But we defeated a nice army a couple times. So our hopes now is maybe finally we could get spread out enough up here in the northern regions to uh, be able to see what's your go ahead decimate you uh, to be able to do stuff economically to finally recover uh, things of that nature so we're going to use our spies in these next few turns to act as outposts since they have a large viewing area so we can see what's going on who's coming at us and we can react appropriately I've said this for like the last two episodes I think but we're gonna try and do an economic episode focus entirely on economics recovering and building up our military strength <coughs> So this may or may not have a battle in it. I guess it depends on who comes at me, how they come at me, and those sort of things. <coughs> so yeah, that that's uh, what's going on. I did, based on a suggestion, uh, labeled the new horde the Pale Riders. I rather like that since that's kind of appropriate. I found out, I think this is the Wall of Gorgon. I think it's Gorgon. I'll have to look real quick again. Uh, I looked it up. It's a pretty legit little wall. I'm not going to lie. Critical failure. Critical failure. Mutiny imminent. The F, David Blaine. So, let's go ahead. That's Transcapia. <clears throat> Everyone's in Transcapia right now. Yep. Okay. To work then. Okay. How can I help? Their blood will no one's over here. Soil. Uh, we're gonna assassinate you. Critical success. Of course. What is this? It's an area I can't go into. That's Transcapia. What is this? Oh, I'm looking, sorry, I'm looking in the wrong thing. That's Dostan. That's Dostan. That's Kath. Where's that line? Ready for okay, so he's in Kath. <clears throat> I'm still a little too close to be comfortable with... Where is he at? Is he in... See in Daistan. Okay. Your next command. What would be over here? That's Kath. That's Kath. I have to move all the way over here. I'm not going to do that. What's this? Daistan. Merv. As long as I can get enough warning, it'll be okay. What is this area? Hold on. This is Merv. Is that where he is? I'm kind of droning, but I'm trying to figure out how in the freaking crap I'm going to do this. You know what? We'll move this dude. Over here. For one turn, we won't have this horde. That's fine. What do you want? Try to keep all the units at bay that we can. In the turn, real quick. Yes, I've already ordered his decimation. <clears throat> there we go. So anyways, I hope you guys are having a good week. 
Um, let's see, updates on the channel. I have my 2015-2016 review coming out either today or tomorrow. I don't know, it depends. Um, Ark Survival Evolved, that playlist, I think I'm actually going to switch to like a, uh, a Tuesday-Saturday. Uh, there's not a whole lot of... I have to have a lot of work in between each episode, so I might do that a Tuesday, Thursday instead of, or Tuesday, Saturday instead of a Tuesday, Thursday, and that gives something on the weekends to look forward to, that sort of thing. Lost. Kath, our troops have become disoriented. In unfamiliar lands, and much time has been lost as they retrace their steps. The frickin' crap is that about? I really don't know. Starting out. Okay, agent exposed. War on Egypt and Axum. Decimation, right gained. Dark shadows loom. He's using being used as an outpost. So what we'll just destroy want? him. I will and then we're gonna gain just some success. Success. Just killing off agents. This guy's leveled up. Lebed. Outer King. We're going to go campaign movement range and melee attack. Then we're going to get recruitment costs and charge bonus. Nothing I can really do outside of that, right? Yeah, none of us can build. But we're making a lot of money and a lot of food, so it's all worth it. Actually, I think I'm on the highest money thing. I'll have to check next time. I do very much enjoy playing as the White Huns. They're a lot of fun. We have this setback, which is costing us a few episodes, but you know what? That's okay. I do not plan on this uh, ending by the time Warhammer comes out, unless I'm just getting that Unless I just get some really good breaks. So this will spill over into Warhammer, which will be a little tricky. But we'll handle it. Move faster. Come on. Lugians. It's fine. They can all do whatever in the heck they want. It's free country. Well... I guess it's not over there. I'm just thinking of America. Hostile agent success. Deceive. Can I not do anything? I can still assassinate him. Failure. That's not acceptable. Let's just, uh... Let's just assassinate. Success! You're still going down. We are on the highest level. What happens when we knock it down one? We're still making four grand. That's good. I'll take it. Toro Mana has leveled up. Congratulations, sir. Missile damage. Integrity. And you need something there. Missile damage plus five for bow cav. Gods be praised. Excitement. Here we go. How many more turns is that military setback? Crying out loud. Um, we could do that, but that's food consumption. That's something we don't have a lot of. This guy can level up. Not level up. I guess level up. Whatever you want to call it. We got food consumption. We could do integrity. I feel like this is a good one. Growth plus 10 when in camp, so we could get right back funneling into it. Alright, yep. Yeah, I think this is going to be our economic episode. 
So just be prepared, ladies and gents. <clears throat> Unless someone comes at us, there will be no battles. Which means a lot of quick interns. Of course, assuming Sassanids and other people don't do anything to us. Because I want to be able to come back in full force. Pretty freaking hard. And just, uh completely wreck the Sassanids. Oh! He done did got killed. Oh, they are gonna make a move on me. That's fine. That's fine. It's a lot of troops. But I have agents. If I make it really hard for them to do anything, then they may just back off again. For the gods. Hostile agent activity. Deceive. Distract was a critical failure. The dark. The shadows take them. Yes. Oh, success. You're doing good, dude. I like it. Hinder the army. We are going to misdirect. Needs to be a success. Critical success. What is your movement range? Minus 105. That's epic. Misdirect this army. Success. Minus 50%. That's good. So this turn... We need to get, what, Step Horse Archers or Hunnic Horse? Trying to think. We have Medium Bow or Light Bow. This guy does more melee and melee attack. They both have the same range. Missile accuracy is the same. Missile damage is the same, pretty much. I'm tempted to go hunting horse archers. I mean, step horse archers have more health. But aside from that, hunting horse archers seem to be the way to go. We do need some step raiders as well. Noble Akaziri warriors. We'll do that. No one can reach me this turn. So no problems there. No problems there. Yep, in the turn. I want the assassins to come looking for me, and then I want them to find me, and I'm just like a wall of horse archers and stuff. Just completely and totally buffed up. And they're like, oh, crap. And I was like, yeah. And they're like, dang, we shouldn't have come up here. And I'm like, nope, you shouldn't have. They want me dead so bad. <laughs> so, so bad. We're going to have to get rivalry. Again, I'm going to have to bring in these two hordes. I think that's Havoc's Fury and Scourge of the East, because this is King Gilla's, King Gilla's hammer. King Gilla's or King Gilla's? Not sure. Not sure. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Yeah, we're really going to have to do some backing off. Well, we had a good run at it. That's for sure. Success was... Distract with success. Misdirect army. Oh. You cheeky little dude. You cheeky little piece of crap. Yep, we're just going to have to get right behind. We still don't have a huge army. At all. So what we're going to have to do... Get some step raiders. 
over here. You are just going to get some more hunted horse archers. I'm going to get stuff two units of Spet Zion, so that's fine. I'm going to get some noble dudes there. Okay, how many did you were you able to get? I'm do that, so at least he can get one. No. I guess we'll see what happens. These guys, golly, they're just. Mm. Yep, you're just gonna have to not be there. Won't know what hit them. You. Misdirect. Success, good. What do you want? Let's get. If I put this here. Yep, I'll rather have you dead. Success, that's good. Did he get hit again? Please kill him. Thank you. Are there any? Are there any? We could recruit, but we don't have enough money. That's fine. So let's see. He can't get to us. That guy can't. This guy probably could. He can't. Neither can they. I feel like this is all of the Sassanids, though. So if they do come after us and we are prepared for them, we could kill them. We could kill a lot of them. Oh, this is slightly stressful. I want to make like a not boring campaign and I feel like right now it's becoming very boring. I know as like the Huns we shouldn't retreat but at the same time I have to retreat or else I would die and then stop attacking me. I'm trying to get my other- that's right dude. Don't screw with me because I will kill you. So many troops. But the longer they wait, or the longer it takes for them to get there, the more I can build up. So, fingers crossed, all that good stuff. The main issue that I'm coming up with against is running out of ammo with my horse archers before a battle can even start before a battle is over with I should say Macron what are you doing agents everywhere was a success distract hostile agent activity misdirect was a success Oh my word, just go. Agents have all been exposed, I don't even care. Factions emerged. Atropatine and the Lachmids, that's fun. Okay. Gloves are coming off, dude. How much does he make? He makes 378. Yes. Oh, it's keeping me in the positive, so. Okay. How is this going to work? They still have to cross the river. Where is there a river crossing? Anywhere. So, if I post up here... See, I need these guys. These are my the noble lads. bros. We need good fighters. I post up here. I can just Warriors barely camp. I wasn't even paying attention. Good. Thirsty for battle. Oh, these guys take two turns regardless. Okay, well no, I'm gonna get step raiders. For the gods. Yeah. There we go. Come. You're in camp there. Your next command. And you, good sir, come sit. Going to encamp there. To work, then. Really? 
Nothing more. Let's get over there. Um. Who do I want to I hold back more? The ravens come. Rather assassinate. Then maybe a little less. Or unless it fails. Good freaking criminy. Well, nothing we can do. Let's just do it. We'll be in the negative next turn. Income wise, but that's alright. That is all right. We're losing 45% of our industrial, essentially, to rivalry. This is why rivalry is uh, such an important feature. Uh-uh. Uh-uh, you are not going to retreat. They saw how many dudes I had. They're like, oh, snap. And I was like, uh, yeah, snap. And they're like, no, uh, and I was like, yeah, I'm gonna come after you, cause you're pissing me off. I'm gonna use my agents as uh, a means to prevent Sassanid armies from running away. We're gonna pick them off one by one, unless they turn around and fight me, which would be fine. I wouldn't be upset with that. Same with like Macron. I think I'm just gonna get him. Gonna pick him off, deceive, and... S oh. Okay. You, want? you are dead. Go away. Oh, yes. my word. So annoying. I am the knife of the dark. Sabotage. Good. Um, let's hinder this army. Come, six. Share my fire. Opportune failure. Of course. Then we've got, who are these? Do Iran. See if we can't get a piece with Iran. Nope. Who else am I at war with? Him, I don't care about speak. that. Tanukids. Slovenians. The Allens, Iran, and Macron. Warriors all. Tropatine and Arya have all resettled, so we've got some major things to get through. For the tribe. Slightly pisses me off. Got my full army there. Got 14 out of 20. Got 11 out of 20. 300 each. Nope. What do they even have? I can do that. Those guys are easy. That's a lot of cav. That's a decent amount of cav. I mean, we'd have a lot of cav to deal with. I feel like it might not be the worst thing, though. Like, what if I could go down here? I just need... I need to take the Sassanids on. That's... My whole thing right now. I don't want to. And it might not end very well, but it needs to happen. Get moving. Thirsty for battle. Hmm. That's interesting. Move, what God if I move you up a little bit? Excitement. Get moving, you wretches. On the move, huh. lads. Ready for battle. That sucks. That really sucks. Oh well. Starting out. You have more orders? If this guy dies, it's not going to be the end of the world. It would suck. I'm not concerned. How far down does this go? You know what? I really don't have to do it, so I'm not going to. End the turn. Let's see if they attack me, and if they do, we'll call it the end of the episode, and then next turn, that's all it'll be. So we did work on our economics just a little bit. Not enough as, I, as much as I had wanted to. But such is the way of things. Can't always get what you want. And these guys have to stop spamming agents. 
Just stop it, please. They're all going to retreat to this little mountain pass. Yep. Christ weeps when men battle. That's all right with me. Hopefully Macron doesn't join the war against the Ostrogoths. I need money. I will do anything basically for money. Prostituting my faction out. Okay, all right, all right, all right. Let's get this done. Macrons don't move. Don't do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. There's another agent. That's right, you missed. You sack of crap. Okay, let's see what we got here. Distract was a critical failure. Assassinate was an opportune failure. Political gang, Octar, uh, blocked the promotion. Agents exposed. War declared. Preserved food wagons. That's good. I shall see them to the Go a bit praised. How can I success? Please say he can move. He can think. The Lord. Okay, so who do we want to lag behind? How can I help? Let's do these guys. What do you want? What or, do you yeah, those guys. That's who I said. I sure. Misdirect. Success. Minus 50%. That's not a whole lot, but that'll work. Am I setting myself up for failure? Let's see. Those will suck. That's what, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven-ish. Eleven units that I have to deal with of horse archers. Then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, essentially. Ten units of other cav. Quad be praised. How can I help? It'd be it'd be interesting, man. I don't know. I feel like I'm faster than they are, but at the same time I always underestimate. See that's 10, 21, 24, 34. Come, six, so not even all of them could come in at once. That's good. But at the same time, twenty. 34, not all of my dudes could come in at once. What if I set up at this mountain pass? Let's do that. Set up here. Gods be praised. Excitement. Warriors all. Come in right behind. You set up camp. You come up right behind me. and set up camp. And then you come down from behind. Again, if I lose the Pale Riders, it's not going to kill me. I mean, financially, they're not super contributing. They're just keeping me in the positive. So, Let's see what the Sassanids do if they want to take me on. That's a lot of troops they have. I feel like I could take them. Maybe I'm being a little cocky and arrogant, but you know what? I'm so tired of the Sassanids. Like, what are they doing? You know what? That's fine. Go down there, because I'm going to come in and I'm going to rape and pillage all your lands. <laughs> That's what I'm going to do. You can catch up to me if you want, but in the meantime, I'm going to wreck you. Or not. I don't... Uh, they're going to play a game of cat and mouse, and I just don't want to do it. I don't want to play cat and mouse. I want to play You're Gonna Die. That's what I want to play. Am I right? Am I right? Am I right? Am I right? 
All right, let's see. Famine. Yep. Disrepute. That's awesome. Ready for battle. Okay, so this is what we're gonna have to address next turn. See the end of this episode, guys. I do thank you for watching. Uh, we're gonna take out this army, the Forgotten Warriors. I think they've kind of left them behind as a sacrifice, which is perfectly all right by me. Sacrifice your own guys. We're gonna misdirect this dude. It's a failure. What happens when we misdirect this guy? Failure. Sabotaging. And critical success. Sweet. Minus 75%. We couldn't catch up to him. We probably won't. But that is all right. So, anyways, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, uh, if you enjoyed this little economic part, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. If you haven't already, hit that subscribe button. We will focus on the Sassanids again. Uh, we have to. I have to kill this army. There's just something inside of me that's tearing me apart. But if they continue to move north, I'll let them settle this area. That's fine. I'll come in and take all their lands, sack all their major settlements, come in and take out Macron and do some damage. So if you have any other suggestions, go ahead and leave them in the comment section down below. Thank you again, guys, for watching. This is Havoc, and I'm out of here. Peace.